Hiking around in the rainforest, hunting for deer pellets, is a common occurrence if you're a wildlife biologist. But for students at DZ Middle School, it was all part of a hard day's study. Going up and we're collecting deer pellets to find out the population along the different the study required students to work together in groups of three, taking notes and making observations at varying locations and elevations all along Fish Creek Road. The type and frequency of food sources in each one meter wide swath was tallied and the presence of any pellets or droppings, a telltale sign of deer, were gathered for further study. Each test area was at a new elevation. Students were led by a compass reading to locate the next sample area. Volunteers and parents joined in the fun and had a few things to say about the outing. I'd go out with uh, the pellet group crews and we would visit about 30 drainages in southeast Alaska every year and do exactly what the, what the boys and girls are doing here is uh, look, at the, look at the habitat that's, that's there, the, the food for the deer, the canopy, the old growth, what kind of forest it is around there and then uh, count the uh, number of deer pellet groups uh, in a, in a, along a certain transect line and, and from that we get a relative idea of how many deer are in that particular range compared to others or from that year to the next year and so forth. Um, hopefully they can be a little bit more in touch with uh, Alaska, uh, apply stuff from the classrooms to what they would encounter in, in Alaska, help out um, uh, get some real life application. Come spring the classes will head back into the rainforest to wrap up their study and draw their conclusions.